Hey, Adam. So you know how you're coming on my channel and you make a comment under a, a, a fake profile and you say things like you go, you go into somebody else's question or comment and you say she's full of shit or you make other comments that, oh, well, that, I didn't understand what you meant by that video because you're an idiot because it takes an idiot to not understand what I've been putting out. So you doing that is firing my fuel. Do you understand what you're doing? You and Dex, with all your bot accounts, and now you're getting Ilea and everybody else do all of them. And I say her because she's the one that 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 tried to, you know, think she had she could talk to me. Because she's new. She has no idea what you've done in the past. And she's googly eyed for you guys. You're her friends. So whoever one of you is coming on my channel, I take it straight back to you, Adam. And you're making it worse. You're firing the fuel. Because wait till you see my next video. Not the one about you being, um, uh, wanting to join the one after that. Oh, you're going to love that one. Keep it up because the more you come on my channel with your little fake accounts and come, try and come at me. Oh, and then everybody, he deletes them. He'll make a comment so that that person gets it and sees it and then he deletes it. But he doesn't understand. It stays, stays in my, I, I still see it. You don't see it, but I see it. So I'm taking screenshots. So, so Adam, keep it up, keep it up because you're just firing the fuel. Wait till you see my next video. I can do this forever. I can do this forever. Do you hear me, Adam? Because I'm not going to let up until you openly apologize to all of us by name and why you're apologizing to each one of us. I'm not going to stop. You stole that money from those veterans, from the charity. It was a fraud. The whole time. Jaystone got so mad at you and Dex for whatever reason. You probably weren't giving her enough. And she told WV, West Virginia Prepared Mind. She went visit her and told her what you guys were doing. And then Snafu Snaps called you out on it. Well, he actually called Terry France. And Terry France is ready to pull the gun, so to speak. Because that's, that's the reference he likes to use his guns. Because he thinks he's some kind of a big man. He ain't nothing but a thieving little, little weasel. But you got him to go on your side. and because How much money did you give him? Because we know you're worth six mil. God knows how much Dex is worth. And you bring him on your channel and both of you lied. Both of you lied through your teeth. You are a thief. You are a liar. You're a sociopath. Narcissistic fool. That's what you are. You had the most amazing team before you brought in all these idiots. You had all of us older women that adored you, would have done anything for you except all this garbage. I don't know how I got caught up in it, but my idiot Al self did. So I'm including myself in the idiocy because I followed you like a fool. But now I'm awake and now I know better. And you brought all these little, little demon worshippers on here. And now y'all are trolling. You're going to kitty porn sites. You're going to a site that, that, and this is the site I'm talking about, you're going to his site and you're engaging a channel that's fetishes are in eating poop, hurting the little children in the most grotesque ways, bondage with the little ones, and killing the little ones. You and your mods have turned so disgusting. All of them were in that channel. And now, you're going into a channel that says that all you got to do is join join his subscription. Just join his channel, pay him, and he'll save your life. Because he helps druggies and alcoholics and whatever. And a guy died and he said, oh, too bad he wasn't subscribed. Do you not hear who you watch? He's saying the guy wouldn't have died had he had enough money to join his ch little channel over there. You people are the most foul, disgusting, pitred, diseased animal on the face of the planet, you and your mods. And Dex, he's just a big slug, slugging around, sloshing all over him. You make me sick to my stomach. You unmodded me because I didn't agree with Jacob Israel's teaching, his doctrine, it's wrong. 
and global witness. They're both have wrong doctrine. They're both wrong. And I said that. And you you, you unmodded me for that. I wasn't mad that you unmodded me. It was the reason you unmodded me. Because you turned to a Luciferian channel. And all your subscribers think you're this amazing Christian. When you and your entire crew, all your mods, are all Luciferian. All of you. And Dex, you know, when I first, you know, met you over the phone, I thought, I thought you were a nice guy. I thought your wife was very nice. As long as we stay on your side. As long as we do your bidding, you're a nice guy, right? But the minute we stray away or don't want to follow your your plans of hurting people, that's that's when you and your wife let the demons out. Because before that, I just thought you were the nicest people ever. Just like the other mods. I was fooled. I was fooled with your little speech about wanting the truth. And then I find out what y'all did to me. And then I find out that after all the attacks stopped on Shauna, you and your beast wife and Adam kept the attacks going to the point of threatening her life and her parents. Why, for what reason would you send somebody to her home to threaten her that she had to get a restraining order? More is coming out, a lot more. Text messages, voice messages. Oh, you haven't heard a thing yet. I've been playing patty cake with you. Like a child, like children, I've been playing patty cake with you, hoping that you would apologize and stop your BS. But that's not working, is it? So it's time to play big boy games. Yes, it is. Hey, Dex, has anybody gotten beat up in your home lately? I wonder. You know, Adam, when you give another man access to your wife, things don't usually go so well. You know, the piece of advice my dad gave us when we were of marrying age, when we started turning 18, 19, you know what he said to us? We were all, I remember we were all at their, their house. We were um, probably Friday night. We'd always get together when we were a lot younger. And, um, you know, we'd play poker, you know, we'd just laugh. I told the brothers, they would have us laughing in stitches for hours. They were so funny. And just telling us stories, you know, things. And anyway, I remember one time my dad said, he said, um, well, my one of my brothers was going to allow one of his friends to live with him, a friend just a guy. And this was what brought it up because he had mentioned it. And my dad said, don't you ever, ever bring another male or female into your home to live. He said, that is the worst thing you can do because you're giving the devil a foothold, a foothold to destroy your marriage. Is that what you did, Adam? Did it go that far? Because I think there's a little something, something going on in the background, right? You want to play with me? You want to come on my channel? Both of you, fools, make comments, stupid comments. As if, as if they're going to make me stop. <gasps> oh my goodness, they said I'm full of shit, I have to stop. Oh my goodness, what am I going to do? Or, I didn't understand a thing about your last video when every one of my videos has been perfectly clear. And to people that really want to know, I give them links. But I already know when it's you guys. So I just ban you from my channel. But if, do you really think by putting even a nice comment that I'm not going to ban you from my channel? Because I don't care about like, subscribes, and hit the bell. You don't care if people talk about you because you know you've been taught even if they talk bad, they're engaging and it results to money. So you don't care on your channel. Unless they talk about Dex, <laughs> Dex, unless they talk about what? But let's say it together. Ready, everybody, all my subs, one, two, three, unless they talk about data mining. Mm -hmm. You, they, Your mods are on that in a hot minute. Yes, they are. Or if somebody says, hey, Elsie Jaycee's over there talking about you. What is, you know, what's going on? And the mods delete it before anybody could see it because we have a few seconds to mod, right? Before people can actually see a post. <laughs> you don't let that on your channel, do you? Nope. But just people just running their mouths and stuff. You don't want them deleted because it, it makes money. Well, I delete them because I don't give a damn about YouTube's money. 
It's all run by Satan, all of it. So I don't care about that. I do care about getting out the truth. I do care about that. So I have no problem deleting anybody that sides with you. That questioning me is fine. I'll give them links. They can figure it out themselves. But nobody on my channel will go against me. I'll get rid of them. I don't need that. I don't want it. I already know the truth. I've already re I I did my research. I did my research. Not what y'all YouTubers say. I did my research. Yeah. Did that. Went to that park. Got the t-shirt. Guess what? I'm off the ride. And now it's content after content after content. You have hurt so many people. In my music video, that was just a handful of people you hurt. That, that's not everyone that was hurt in your wake. As you sloshed your sluggish goo across the internet. I have never been more disgusted about two human beings in my life. Three, your wife. Because she led the campaign against Shauna. Yes, yeah, she did. That's why I call her a beast. She led that campaign. She wouldn't stop. After we all agreed, because Snafu Snaps was the bulldog, we all got together. Snaps, you need to listen to this. We all got together on the phone. All of us mods, every single one of us that were involved in the attacks. If you weren't involved in the, in the attacks and you know you weren't in that room, you don't need to respond with, I wasn't there, it wasn't me. We already know that. We're talking about the ones that I've been naming. If I have not named you and put a picture up of you and spoke of you, then we're not talking about you, okay? We're talking about mods from 2019 to current. But we're throwing Rip Curl in there because he's getting involved in this now. Okay. But so Rip Curl, sit down, buckle up and hold on tight, honey, because you have no idea what you're doing. You and I, Leah, might want to stay back in the little leaks because you, you have no clue, neither one of you, as to what these two people, Adam and Dex, are capable of. So back to Snafu. All of us mods that were modding during that time, every single one of us, we were all on a phone call and we agreed that we would stop the attacks. They were done. We're going to do it anymore. And we, and we did. But then here goes little Miss Beast, Lex, Michelle, Dex's wife. Here she goes going over in your channel because you were still, you were still trolling for, for Adam. And she goes into your channel continuing the attacks. And I remember me, WV, and CJ, and, and um, J Stone. First, it was just me and WV that talking about it, that we were not happy with what she was doing. Then CJ came in, in Discord, and she's like, what's going on? And we said, we're just not happy about a particular person won't stop the attacking. After we all agreed, she's still going into Snafu Snap's channel, and 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 starting trouble. And we all agreed to stop, to leave Shauna alone and to stop. And we agreed because Snaps and Snaps wouldn't stop because he was being told what to do by Adam Dex because he wouldn't stop. We all agreed that we would mod for him as ghosts, but we would not go into the room. We would not show our names in there. And I remember the first time I saw Lex in there, I sent her a message in Discord and I said, hey, I thought we were not going to... um." Um, mod for snafu meaning openly she sent me back a discord message so nasty she said nobody tells me what to do and that like she saw god almighty that little demon disgusting human being so i sent her a message back no you misunderstood me i wasn't telling you we weren't going to i was asking you because we all agreed and then she sent me back something else really nasty and I tried to talk to, to Dex to talk to her, but that didn't work because, you know, he, you heard his wife, he'll come at you. But he's the only one allowed to do that, right, Dex? Because I, I was married to somebody like you. Yes, I was. And if anybody tried to hurt me, he, it wasn't going to happen. He did. I seen him one time. We were at a house party. He was a Marine. We were at a house party. And some guy said something to me. And my, my ex-husband heard. And 
it, two seconds, the guy was laid out flat, bloody face, everything. I, I never seen anything like it. I didn't, I mean, I knew he was abusive towards me, but to see him do something like that to another man, I mean, I was beside myself. I couldn't believe what I was seeing. But behind closed doors, he did the same thing to me often. Often. That's why I divorced him. I gave him five years of my life. And then I said, hell no, father did not put me on the earth to be treated like this by another human being. Because I never saw that abuse in my home. And my parents, not, uh, when they were fighting, they'd speak in Spanish, real soft and loving tones when they argued. We never knew they were fighting, ever. They never let us see them fight. And, and when he fight, it was verbal. And they kept it from us. So my whole life, through that five years, I, I was taught how to treat a woman. And my we were all taught that men don't hurt women. You don't hit them. You don't call them names. Arguing is one thing. Physical abuse. So I, I got rid of him. Five years, I gave him my life and I left. But you guys, I, I think I think y'all might stay together forever because you, you're both a demon. So after Lex did all that, that is when me and WV and CJ and Jay Stone were all in this chat room. But first it was me and WV, then CJ came in. And we were pretty, we were, me, and, me and WV, we were pretty pissed because we weren't happy with the, with the attacking. And, um, CJ came in and she's like, what's going on? And we said, well, we all agreed to stop the attacks, but there's somebody who keeps doing it and we're not too happy about it. She said, who? And I said, well, you know, we figured it out, me and WV on our own and, and we know, we know who it is, but you know, you need to find out who it is. And cause we weren't going to tell her. And she said, well, who are we talking about? And me and WV were just quiet and we're just like, I finally said, look, whoever says her name is out because we knew that somebody would go running to her, CJ. And then CJ said, W, she said, um, oh, Lex. And we're like, yeah. And she's like, yeah, but, but see by now, CJ's already in Lex's pocket. Yeah. She's in there sniffing the poop. And Jay Stone comes in and she heard us talking. She's like, well, what's going on? And we're like, tried, you know, tried to give her a heads up and told her the same thing. Well, someone's still going into snaps, attacking other people. And we all agreed to stop, but there's one person who won't stop. And she's like, oh, well, who? And we're like, well, you have to figure it out yourself. And she, Jay Stone acted so dumb. And at the time I believed her because Jay, you're good at acting dumb. Yes, you are. So she left. CJ or Jay Stone left left the chat. And it was just us three talking for a little bit. But we had agreed to stop the attacks. So soon after that is when Lex came into the channel and went after me. I did a video on that. But I just stayed away. I left. I didn't I didn't engage in, in with the mods or with in any of them for for a long time. And in that time, I don't know what mods continued the attacks, but I'm pretty sure a lot of them stopped. I'm not sure. But I do know that Dex, Lex, and Adam did not stop the attacks on Shauna. They kept it going for months after at least I thought they were done. And, um, so snaps, I don't know if you knew that or not, but we were, we all agreed to stay away from your channel and or only ghost mod. And so they were backstabbing you left and right, Dex and Lex and Adam. They were all backstabbing you back then. And you know, I have no reason to lie. I have not lied yet. I've been told the truth about everything and I'm not lying now. They were attacking you behind the scenes. And and this was one of the ways which we were told to stop, but Lex kept it going because she wanted to keep you going. So you kept doing their, their dirty work. Now, looking back at everything, now, now I know everything is more clear to me. I didn't know it at the time, but now with everything that's come out, that's what was going on during that time. 
I was so stupid. I didn't even understand all of that back then. But I do understand all that now. So Dex, Lex, and Adam, keep your disgusting feces fingers off my channel. You are not allowed to sling poop in my direction. You would do better to get some scented baby wipes and wipe each other's asses of the vile, putrid feces. Now engulf your entire essence of being into the most grotesque stench that not even the angels can come and minister to you.